Okay guys, it's uh, August 30th. I'm um, gonna follow in my GPS location of the phone. They might have tossed it across the street. And I'll walk in and I'm gonna go talk to Curtis. He says he might have, um, I asked Curtis, the, my, one of my friends from last year when I was doing all the interviews, said he would look around for me and try to figure out the names. And uh, I'm gonna try to spot the, the main, the woman, the short haired girl white bleached hair kind of white bleached hair on a bicycle and another guy on a bicycle big guy and then the really tall guy who was most trying to throw most of the punches in the beginning before they yelled get get him so we'll see what uh we're just approaching that tent city here guys in the morning at like almost eight o'clock this in this area here blue there's rep code rep code and the next one over Hey, Curtis. So, you did have any luck? Um, no. Are you asking people about my phone? Yeah. Uh, and then I got stung by the 20 hornets last night. Yeah, that's no good. Yeah, did you kind of like ask on there? Did you, you know there's like the, the tall guy? He's like 6'4. He usually has a shirt off. You know, he's kind of medium build. He was like the one that was attacking me. Do you have any idea? I was in my tent. Like, no, no. Do you, do you remember him? Did he hang around here often? Tall guy, like he's you know the tallest guy here. You know, I know Slinky, the Twiggy, Twiggy. Yeah, but you're not quite sure if he hangs around here a lot or sleeps here. I don't. Know. Okay. Well, thanks for inquiring. There's only like a couple tall guys. Yeah, because I'm like six one, and so he's he's like above me. Like, oh really? So he's probably oh, like six three, right? Okay, so he's tall guy. Yeah, because I remember he was punching me from above. Oh wow. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, not fair. Who do we know that's really tall, Blake? Blake, who do we know that's really tall, like 6'3"? Huh? Who do we know that's really tall, 6'3", six, 6'4"? Three, six, who do we know that's really tall, 6'3", six, 6'4"? Three, six, uh, Twiggy. Twiggy, yeah. White, white dude, is he bald or a little bit of hair? No, not bald, but uh, hair very close cut. To yeah, the yeah, head. and he's probably like above us, right? Yeah, sounds about right. That and, sounds like Twiggy. Yeah, he, and um. Why? What's going on? Oh, he stole my phone yesterday. He stole your phone yesterday. Yeah, yeah, he was trying to punch me and steal my phone. Um, I think his tent, he was with a, a girl in the tent over down, just down here, not too far, like right next to you guys, I think, right? Uh, no. No? No, no, no. Uh, he would live, uh, maybe about six-ish tents down that way. Yeah, like an orange, is like a big setup or a small setup? Yeah. It's um, but with a square top, right, I can, like, um, it's kind of like a canopy with a tent. Um, no, just a tent? Well, yeah, no, he, 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 I wouldn't say it's a canopy necessarily. Hmm? Okay. He's, he was with some, yeah, some girl was in there he mentioned or whatever. He called it her wife or whatever for some reason. And His wife? Yeah. I was talking to her and when he went like all crazy to me, right? Um, Did she sound kind of like... She's a little older, you know, 40, 50. Maybe a little bit like... She, yeah, she, maybe it was really blonde, does. really blonde hair the girl had, I think, or oh, something extreme. No, no, no. Maybe she had really extreme hair. I don't remember. She, she's, she's not blonde. She's okay, what? Well, she's got dark hair, and she. she it could have been dark. I don't she, remember. She's, she's 
quite nice, actually. Yeah, she seemed but nice. She's, she's yeah, she was nice. But she's a little bit. She sounds maybe a little, a little bit slow. Not like, not mm -hmm. like you know. Oh yeah. Stupid or anything, but like definitely a little. Yeah. Bit slow. Yeah, but yeah. She's a sweetheart. She's but she's in the tent with Twiggy usually. Yeah, and she doesn't usually come out on her own. Like she, she mm -hmm. will stay in. The yeah, tent that's when I ran into time. her in her tent. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I was just talking to her, and then all of a sudden, this guy just went at me. And then, yeah, no, he can be extremely protective of, of his wife. And, uh, he that, calls her his wife. Well, I mean... He like, said it to me. That's what yeah, he said to me. That's yeah, my no, wife or yeah, whatever. Yeah, that is his wife, yeah. Like, literally. L legitimately, that is his yeah. wife, yeah. Okay, and we don't know her name. So uh, maybe I'll find her when I walk up, her but... Her name is, uh... What the fuck? I do know her name. Twiggy and... Twiggy and... Yeah, she doesn't like you there, Curtis? No. I don't know why either. I well, I mean, you're such a, you know, just keeping to yourself, you know, working on your books. Even the Golden Bow right there. Yeah. The Golden, Golden Power? Golden Bow. Oh. Oh, nice, yeah. You still go and read at Knox all the time? Yeah, just to get a little quiet space, right? Twiggy and his wife. His wife? I do know her name, but it escapes me at this moment. What about, you know that girl who was on a bicycle that's like really butch with short hair that's dyed like almost white? Do you know that girl? She was wears baggy clothing, you know, kind of like the butch lesbian clothing style. Short, super short hair. You know, she's kind of medium build, 150, 100. Who's Mandy's Mandy? Who? Who's Mandy? Brandon's Mandy. Brandon's Mandy. No, but she doesn't have white hair. Yeah, like it's short, like a centimeter. Yeah, but she's... They're all long-haired wigs. Mm, no, she had... Well, she had no wig on. She was just short hair on a bicycle. Mm, that doesn't she, ring a bell for me. But then again, I'm, a lot of, I'm usually busy and not... But do you busy. see that girl on the bicycle often? I don't even know. No. No, no like... No, like, the description itself doesn't... I was ring belt ring a belt in my feet different times. I'm usually, well, I'm usually busy fixing people's bikes or working mm. on Yeah, yeah, well, that's so a good... I, I, I don't always necessarily pay the most attention to what's going on in the path as he's coming and going. Yeah. Unless, unless I... I just want to find him, see if I can still find my phone and, you know... Unless I can hear some type of commotion going on, then yeah, I you're not definitely paid. start to pay cool, attention man. to what's going on. Well, you know, I'll um, come back another if, time if and... You, if, you, hey, if you need or desire a hand... Um, you know, and I don't mean like let's rush him. And no, no, I just want but, to talk. But I'm pretty good at communicating. Middle manning situations. Mm -hmm. or note 10. A note ten plus, yeah. A note ten plus. In one of those otter boxes. Okay. Yeah, he 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 attacked me and then like, stole the phone from me. Really? Yeah. Not not nice. No, not nice at all. So, okay, so Twiggy, so, I got Twiggy, so quite and I find his find his quite wife. Aggressive for no real reason, right? Typically, like, or just the, no, 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 like just in that instance. Yeah, because of his wife protecting her. Okay, yeah, no, that's from from me talking that, to her. That, yeah, that definitely does sound like a Twiggy thing to do. Okay, just because well, just because people. You guys don't have a phone still, do you? No. I, so like when Twiggy's, I'll just come back. When do you I think Twiggy will be here? Maybe 10, 11 o'clock? Maybe. I do have a phone. It's dead at the moment. Okay. But as soon as fucking breakfast comes. You can charge it up. I can go and, and, and uh, well, I'm going to go and charge it up because I have some important phone calls I need to make yeah. today. Anyway. What time is breakfast again? 10? Uh, around 8.30. Or 8.30. Right oh, and it's going to be just down here, right? Uh, yeah, the truck will come in here and... Yeah, it's not good, but, uh, okay. Yeah, well, maybe he'll show up for breakfast. I can. We can. You can talk to him for me, yeah, maybe. Yeah, absolutely. What was your name? Marcel. Marcel. Blake. Blake. Nice to meet you, Blake. Appreciate the help. You know, we don't want anybody stealing anything from anybody. I wish. You know, unfortunately, this is a big mecca for it. It is a big mecca for it, and you know what? It is rather unfortunate because it fucks things up for the people who don't. I know, because you can't leave your tent in peace. Well. I mean, that's a risk that I gotta take. I mean, you know what? It's just like if I had a fucking house. Yeah. Yeah, you gotta yeah. always protect it. Well, it's All just right. like I may lock my house or whatever, right? But that doesn't necessarily mean that no one's gonna try to break in my thing. Yeah. Way. You know, so I think what's important is to me that I that I need anything of actual like anything that's actually truly important to me. I've already moved the fuck out of here mm. to another place yeah, that I don't have to worry about it, you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. But it, it is unfortunate that 
you know, people sometimes live from a, a mental place of lack where they feel like they have to do that, otherwise they won't get what they need, which is just not correct. Yeah, you know? okay. Well, I'll, I'll follow up with you and after I'll check out breakfast and maybe yeah, man. And we're all getting hungry. Fucking uh, feel it out, see how you feel, and especially if you have a few things you need to get done today or, or whatever have you, we can always exchange phone numbers and you can give me a shout or I can give you a shout and we can kind of fucking reconvene at some point. Yeah, do you have a piece of paper of... and a pen or anything? Actually, I do. Yeah, I'll write down your number, that'd be great, Blake. If, and then if your phone's on later, um, I can, like, oh, I'll text you and we can. Oh, it'll can... be on. It'll be on. Fucking for, for sure. Oh, I nice. Quite a few important oh, things. I'll just pick this up. Drop this. Pizzeria. Yeah, yeah. Or is that just a menu? I have no idea what that is. <laughs> oh, pen. I got a pen, Blake. Um, just a little piece of. My Stephen Hawking's a brief history. Yeah, I just need a little junk piece of paper. Mm -hmm. Oh, perfect. Yeah, you mind just grabbing a piece? Thanks. Oh, he's got it. Okay. Well, okay. <laughs> All right. You guys are set up. Blake. Okay. Um. Seven seven eight. Seven seven eight. Six five zero. Six five zero. Zero nine zero one. Zero nine zero one. That's my cell phone. You can get a hold of me pretty much. Okay. Um, except for right now because it's dead. But it's okay, dead. I'll give you my name and my number. On. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh shit! See, my phone was stolen. So <laughs> my number. I don't know if you could call a U.S. number, but I could text yeah. you. Absolutely. It's an, so like I had to go get another phone. I, so I, when my US one I had in the past, you know, it's like cheaper. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. I know exactly. Well, I have dual citizenship. I, so I just, re, yeah, I just renewed it or whatever, you know, for thirty dollars for the month. Yeah, which I mean, the thirty bucks for the month. Cheaper than Canada. Cheaper than oh, it's definitely cheaper than Canada. Guys, but it's just not quite as convenient. There you are. So nine two five. What does that say? Eight eight, eight, eight six six three five. Yeah, so I'll send you a text from my phone, All right, and then good. um, when and and Twiggy, and if you see Twiggy, you could text me. Yeah. yeah Your call. Good. You're welcome to call or text, Blake. Okay. I'll but Twiggy I'll, I'll and I'll wife. Send you a text or... And then I'll just come here and um, maybe, and I'll slowly just kind of find you and go from there. Uh, yeah, well, or I'll just go if I see him, you know. But I'll, I'll just try to be. I don't want to get attacked again, though, right? So. No. I want but him, I, him to be I, calm. I don't really see you. Hmm? Yeah, I know. You know what I mean? And he, might, he might have mistaken you for someone else. Or well, yeah, because he thought I was, like, you know, getting involved. You know, he I don't know. You know, his maybe he thought you were harassing her or yeah, I know. hitting on her or something. Well, I mean, he maybe he was probably high at the time, right? He was, like, out of control. Well, you know, he's usually not like that, though. Like, I know Tiggy very well. Very well. Does he normally wear a shirt in the summer? He's normally shirtless out here, too? Because he had no shirt yesterday. If it was a hot day, you know. It's a particularly hot day. He is known yeah. to be shirtless, yeah. but you know, not all the time. But he, okay. he also is not known to fly off the handle. Not, and if he does, it's not very often, and it's usually for a very good reason. So that's another reason why I'm kind of like, perhaps he was took me for somebody else. I don't know. Well, I, I was, I had my um, my phone camera out, and I think the camera trigger, triggered him, That's right? That's probably what did it. Yeah, he triggers That's on camera. That's probably yeah. what did it, because, well, he's had some dramatic yeah. Like, I wanted, you know, I was going to interview the girl, right? And okay. uh, kind of get her story, and boom. Ah, it just went at me. Well, and I mean, also, because there was an incident down here yesterday with another gentleman. Um, maybe you were that gentleman. What did you hear? Actually, wait a minute. Were you riding on some type of e-skateboard? Yeah, something yeah. With the one wheel? Okay, that's That's not why creepy. I'm asking. I know exactly what you're looking for, and I also know that gentleman very well. Oh, that the, well. the one who was chasing with the shirt off? Yes. It wasn't Twiggy. No. Twiggy lives down that way. They're both very tall. Okay. This guy's name is also Curtis, but it's not this Curtis, and it's not the other Curtis, because there's like three or four Curtises down mm -hmm. there. His name is Curtis with a K. He lives this way a couple tents down. He's a very Like good maybe that one right there. Yeah. Yeah. That's well there was a girl in there as well. Okay, yeah. so she had and blonde hair would, maybe. And oh I know exactly what you're talking about. Her name is Sam. Sam. And that is also his, his girlfriend. Okay, his so that so he, I said for very long time. So I was filming her. Yeah. Talking he, to her. He was getting and he over, went, overprotective. He didn't know what was going on. And okay, do you have a pen again? Um, and yeah, I can definitely help with that situation. 
You probably just took your phone, like, not to be... Yeah, it's turned off right now, so... But maybe you could ask him for it back and get it for me. Hell, I, I mean, Absolutely. I'll give you guys, like, I, I, I a could, reward if you, you know, whatever. Hey, man, like, I, I, would, I would accept it, but I wouldn't expect it. You know what I mean? Yeah, I would, it would be a, just appreciation. Shit back and just so that I, I think it was just... A, well, it's a really pain in the ass to redo all your phone, right? And oh, buy a new, I can't afford a new oh. one. They're Dude, so expensive now. You're you're preaching to the choir on that one. <laughs> but I would just like for everyone to have what what they what they what they need back. You know, you should have your phone back. And I I honestly right now it sounds to me like it was it was a misunderstanding and totally. a miscommunication and an overreaction rather than well, you know yeah. rather than having words with you and saying hey man like well the girl on the bicycle mm -hmm. she was chasing me after Curtis kind of went at me and then she was chasing me on the bicycle with yeah. another gentleman on a bicycle another a bigger a wider bigger guy oh, and they God. ran me off their bicycle and then I ran yeah. and they yelled get him. And then another guy just tried to attack me, and then they all had me, and they're all kicking me and punching me on the ground. See, that's fucked up because nobody even, no one even stopped to ask you what the fuck. You I'm were running doing. from, right? Well, my first thing is this: I'm not gonna start attacking somebody. I, like, if you're not attacking me physically, why would I start to do that to you? My first instinct is to. Say, hey, who the fuck are you and what are you doing? No, no, I, nobody wants to get no, hurt. It's no. Nobody should be hurt ever. No, I, and I agree with that. We, I mean, remember in high school, like how little we did little stupid things in high school, fights oh. and stuff, but like, as soon as I became yeah. adult, like, man, you can get injured really easily. Yeah, Just a can. punch to your nose, breaks your nose, you're gonna ruin your day. Your well, week, your month, your well, half a year. You know what, and it's just, it's unnecessary. And I think that as human beings, really, at the end of the day, if we are to live on this planet and actually coexist in a, in a proper way and, and have a good life, communication is key, and so is comprehension as well, you know what I mean? So having, having the ability to open dialogue like that, totally. that's, that's a really important thing.